Hello again, I am Blunty. This right here is an EB Games Starlight Foundation mystery box thing in my bubble of doodle thing. Last week was uh, Starlight Week at EB Games. EB Games being a uh, chain um, a gaming store. I think they're called Game elsewhere in the world. Same company, basically. Anyway, recently they've been doing this thing where once a year they have a Starlight Week where they help support uh, and drive donations to, to the uh, Starlight Foundation, which is a foundation. I can't imagine you don't know, but just in case, it's a foundation that helps support uh, seriously sick kids when they're in hospital. It's, their whole sort of raison d'etre is to try and make these kids' days a little bit happier, a little bit cheerier. Keep their spirits up because uh, I, I can't even, I mean, if you need me to explain to you why it's important to try and keep a kid's spirits up when they're dealing with a serious illness while they're in hospital, then uh, it's just, I don't know, maybe you're a sociopath. Anyway, <laughs> weird direction. I then added twice last week, actually. Uh, once when I picked up my copy of Mario Kart uh, 8 um, Ultimate Super Deluxe Switch Edition. Anyway, so when I took the thing up to the counter, the girl behind the counter said, oh, would you like to also don donate to the Starlight Foundation? I went, oh, hell yes, I would. So do that there. Then um, a few days after that, I uh, noticed on Twitter, EB Games said, hey, we're doing this thing. Mystery boxes of various prices, everything from like, I think $10 all up to $5,000. What I've got here is the $50 um, box which is supposed to be Pokemon themed. I have no idea what's in here. It's fairly light. There's something rattling around in there and sort of by the feel of it, there's a, perhaps a plushie in there or something wrapped in bubble wrap. I don't know, but we're gonna find out. There's a pool tape around here somewhere. Figured I was gonna do a little bit of a live unboxing for it because it is a mystery box. And you know, mystery box is always fun to do a live unboxing of, well, pre-recorded, but you know, I'm not gonna, this is like the first, I mean, the, the, Okay, I don't get what that pull tab is supposed to be for. It doesn't actually release the... Oh no, there's still more. Okay. I was going to say, it doesn't release anything from the box, but there's... Okay, so that didn't that didn't tear along the dotted line either. Uh, there, there is a... Uh, uh, um, your box is sucky, big games. And, ooh, here we go. So, first things first, we have a thank you note from the uh, Starlight Foundation people. Little postcard thing in my bowl of doodler there. Uh, my invoice, which I'm not going to show you. Um, Stylo, thank you for generous donation. I got two. I got two thank yous. They thanked me twice. Did they know I donated twice? How could they know? The first one was basically anonymous because I did it install, paid cash. Spooky. So, ooh, I, ne <laughs> I actually nearly bought this when I was when I loaded up this this mystery box in the cart because uh, I bought this online and it delivered. Uh, I was looking around, so well, you know, I might as well get some other stuff while I'm making an order. I didn't end up doing that, but one of the things I almost got was this Pokemon Bowl set, because my bowls suck. They're boring. Um, oh, socks, good, but they're um, they're Bulbasaur socks. Womp womp. All right, so much for doing a uh, complete sort of unedited unboxing. My camera memory card just filled up. I, I neglected to empty it out before. I started recording the last 80 billion videos I recorded. So, what was I saying? Oh yeah, we're doing a, a live re uh, playthrough of Pokemon Leaf Green on my Twitch channel at the moment. Um, and I, I, I left the uh, choice of starter up to a, um, a survey for my chat room and they picked Bulbasaur. So that's uh, some Pokemon trading card game, Evolutions. 10 additional KB. Okay, we'll do those in a second. And one more thing, which is a... Ah! <laughs> Another thing I have... Uh, stopped myself buying on several occasions because it's it's gimmicky and silly, but I kind of really, really wanted it. It's one of those Powerball charger ones, except this one's flat, not an actual ball, which is just ridiculously inconvenient to carry around with you. This one's in the shape of a Pokeball and is flat, so it can actually be a practical uh, uh, um, battery backup thing. It's nice and thin, too. Let me have a look here. Capacity is 2,500 milliamp hour. Well, that's, that's bugger all. That's, that's like, uh, what, half an iPhone charge? Yeah. What can I use this for then? I have to run at something. Not going to charge my switch, that's for sure. Anyway, Pokemon cards. Let's see what we get. Why not? If I can figure out how to open the pack. There we go. I have been out of the loop as far as Pokemon cards go for a very long time. So if any of these are particularly rare or special, you'll have to let me know. I've got a Caterpie, which I have to imagine is not rare or special. I've got uh, do a do which I have to imagine is not rare or special. We've got a Pikachu. Ooh, Pikachu's got his old classic art. Is the camera even focusing on these? I don't know. I'll, I'll do close-ups. I'll do close-ups of these as we go. I'll, I'll, I'll do that. I'll do editing stuff. So, uh, yeah, that's 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 old fat Pikachu. 
Uh, we've got a Machop there again. Are these are these all old art style? Is that the gimmick of this thing? Evolutions? Is this this is this particular version of the card game or this card series de dedicated to super old art? We've got Growlithe. Uh, ooh, we've got a uh, shiny um, foil. What's her name? Doduo. Uh, we've got a Doug Trio. We've got a Trainer card. Venusaur Spirit Link. We've got a Machoke. We got another Trainer card, which is Super Potion, and we have. Use this code to unlock your online booster pack visit. Okay, so I probably won't show you that code. Apparently you get a, a booster pack from the online version of the game. So there you go. That's what um, that, that's what I got for my uh, for my $50 donation to Starlight Foundation. All of which, 100% of that $50 goes to Starlight, by the way. And this was just kind of a, a way for EB Games to encourage people to give money. By saying, hey, you can give something back by donating to charity. This is all just, you know, this is all a lot of stuff that, they've been, you know, it's been discounted in their stores for some time and stuff like that, and they can't get rid of quickly enough. But it's all cool. This is all Pokemon stuff. Sorry, headphone users. And, um, nice. Bulbasaur bowl. Well, these are plastic. Nice and tough. Get a, yes. Nice. Pikachu. And Squirtle, of course. Okay, so the Bulbasaur one, because Bulbasaur sucks, we'll use that just to, to, to chuck the dirty spoons in when I'm doing my washing. <laughs> um, and Pikachu will be my, I don't know, um, that's, 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 Pikachu is, is where my curry, no, wait. He, that's that, and when I make curry, it's, it's going in the, um, going in the, in the, in the char, 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 charmander bowl, um, I don't know. What's, what's an appropriate food for a Pikachu bowl? Cereal, because you know, powers you up in the morning. I haven't eaten cereal in years. And Squirtle, that's um, for soups, because they're heavily water based, liquid. Soups, curries, cereal. Um, I don't know. I should be kind to of Bulbasaur, he gets a hard life. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get, I was gonna say, I'm gonna get a whole bunch of MMs and just use it as a candy bowl, but I'm off the candy at the moment trying to lose some weight, so again, Bulbasaur is just useless all over the place. I think he sucks though. Are these going to be warm socks? Or are these thin socks? These are fairly thin socks. Nice and stretchy though. They might be comfortable plain socks, I reckon. These are these are socks to keep my feet comfortable on my plane trip. I am going on another plane trip soon. Might be going to Taipei for Computex. Fingers crossed that happens. Nothing's uh, signed, still delivered yet, but... So there you go. Um, I don't know. I just wanted to share that with you guys. Um, as far as the Pokemon Green, Leaf Green... Uh, which playthrough goes. Um, hopefully getting back to that real soon. We'll get as much as, um, as we can before Computex rolls around and uh, that'll be that. Thanks for watching. I am Blunty. And we'll catch you next time. Um, yeah, any better suggestions for the Pikachu bowl? I'm, I'm sure I'm missing something obvious. Sparky kind of energetic food. I, um, mm, 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 mm. I don't know. I like him though. Good size bowl.